Well, it's a very interesting move that Putin has put Gerasimov in charge now. Gerasimov is the chief of the general staff, so he is the number one soldier in Russia. And I think you can probably interpret this as being something of a sign of desperation. Um, Surakovin, who was put in place in October, had a fearsome reputation as being the person that reduced Aleppo and Syria to nothing. So it was really felt that he was the, the really hard man that could make a difference. Well, he clearly hasn't been able to make a difference. The other problem is you've got quite a lot of tension between mercenary groups and the proper Russian armed forces. The Wagner group has been trying to take Bakhmut for some time, terribly keen to achieve a success and to say to Putin, well, we can do it, even if your army can't do it. Mm. But actually, they're struggling and they haven't done it very well. So this attack on Solidar, which is a way of trying to get to Bakhmut, is another throw of the dice. But it's really interesting that Putin now, in some desperation, has put Gerasimov in overall charge. Mm. What's happening in Solidar? Well, it would appear that um, pretty World War I 